guys, this is Aztec. This is just going to be a quick, quick, quick guide for quick swap and using the B2Matic wallet. So you'll start by accessing matic.network. You'll then click products and come down to wallet. Immediately, the website will ask, you know, which type of wallet you're using. In our case, we'll use MetaMask. Click MetaMask sign the transaction. Now you can see here in the top left hand corner we've accessed Matic Wallet V2 and here we have no assets on this wallet but we do have little ETH here in our MetaMask wallet. So we want to move this ETH from layer 1 to layer 2. Very easy. We click move funds to Matic Mainnet. Here you can see that we have Ethereum, we'll do max, and we are moving it to the Matic network from to. If I wanted to switch this and I wanted to send my funds back, I would just click switch, and then it would say from Matic network to Ethereum. In this case, we'll click max here. We'll transfer the funds, continue. We'll click continue again. Shows the amount of ether that you'll be transferring from Ethereum to Matic. Click continue. MetaMask will pop up. We'll confirm our transaction. There is a $12 fee because we're moving it from Ethereum. So Ethereum is doing the work. Confirm. This transaction is in process. Here it says transaction one confirmed. And now that the transaction was confirmed, you can see that the transaction is in route. Your transfer generally takes about seven to eight minutes. All right, now you can see that the transfer was completed and you can confirm by seeing it on Etherscan. Click X. We just Go over here to apps, Matic wallet, and you can see that we have our ether here. Now that you have your Ethereum or whatever asset you have transferred from Ethereum to the Matic network, you can access QuickSwap. Now here's the QuickSwap UI in all its glory. And we are, as you can see here in the top left hand corner, Looking at the swap function, here you can swap any token very affordably. The gas cost on the Matic network is very, very cheap. And before we can swap, we have to switch to the Matic network very easily. You no longer have to set up the Matic mainnet RPC. If you're a new user, you just click switch to Matic. It asks, allow this site to switch the network. Switch network. Click here. Automatically, you are now connected to the Matic network and you can swap at your heart's content. Okay, you can see here by clicking our wallet that we actually have a little Matic. The protocol provides you uh, enough Matic to start making transactions right away. And if you ever need more, you can send it through the Plasma Bridge. Make sure that you send it to the Plasma Bridge. And for all of the tokens, you send them through the Proof of Stake Bridge. Now, one easy way to go ahead and send everything back in the case that we wanted to would be to just make one transaction on Ethereum. So what we'll do is we'll sell our USDC for Ether. In this case, we'll click swap, click USDC, ETH, MAX, Going to swap our USDC for ETH. Confirm the swap. Confirm MetaMask. And as you can see here, we have swapped our USDC for ETH. So if we go back to the Matic Wallet V2, you can see here that we successfully swapped our USDC for Ether. 
And the entire balance is in Ether now, $395. We have a little Matic here. So we want to go ahead and withdraw this Ether. We'll click Withdraw. And it takes us now to the Matic Bridge V2. And as you can see here, it says from Matic Network to Ethereum. If I wanted to switch this, just click switch. But because we're moving our ETH from Matic to Ethereum, we'll click Max. We'll transfer it. Click on Continue. 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 We'll confirm in MetaMask. Now the transaction is in process. Now we're waiting for the checkpoint, and it does say that it can take up to three hours for this to happen. All right, so the checkpoint has arrived. Go ahead and click continue. MetaMask pops up. The fee here transfer back to Ethereum because Ethereum is doing work. Transaction is processed. All right, and as you guys can see, it's now completed. And we can go ahead and check our wallet here. See that the funds have arrived back in MetaMask.